pop that up, um, give folks a chance in case they missed it to to take this in, and we'll break this down here in a little bit. Um, we're not going to go through all these points because you know we're going to talk more about what's coming next week for season two. But um, you know, I think clearly the thing that we know jumped out the most to our community, uh, which was expected, is the dates for season two in particular. Um, and in this case, I think it's safe to say it probably was a surprise to most people that season two will will, will last longer than they expected. Yep. Um, Joseph, can you just talk a little bit about like why are we making this deliberate decision to essentially extend season two? You know, I, I also want to just acknowledge last year, well before launch, we had we had talked about yes, you know, at face value, our our goal and our vision was yep. a season would last approximately ever every three months or so. That's, That's right. Generally, the norm, you know, in the industry. Um, we then realized that season, you know, launching the game was going to be challenging in its own right, and yep. we would need some extra time before season two was ready. Yep. Also, to your point about team health and that we don't want to, yep. you know, really hurt the team in a negative manner. Mm -hmm. um, so I think some people were not expecting uh, that we would also need to extend season two itself before we get into the next season. So just yep. a little bit of context from you, I sure. think, would be helpful there. Well, one thing to make really clear none of us inside of 343 look at this roadmap and are happy with it. You know, yeah. all of us want to be doing things faster to deliver more content. You know, we still have this desire to get into a rhythm, a healthy rhythm where we can ship a season every three months. So for us internally, it was painful, frankly, to communicate this roadmap with a season that was going to run for another six months. But the reason why we're doing that is exactly what we talked about before. We have to prioritize going after quality of life issues that are impacting the game right now. Like today, when you fire up the game, that's our number one priority. We're still working on additional seasonal content, but we need to create space for the team to rigorously go after these improvements that matter right now. You know, you and Uni just talked about the outlines, for example. It's one example of many, 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 many things that doesn't matter three months from now. Yep. It's, a, it's a right now kind of thing. And so that's really how we're organizing ourselves to go after that, that work and why we're extending the season now. But to, again, to underline this, none of us looks at that and says, great, six month seasons are awesome. They're not, they're really, they're not. And we need to get ourselves in a position where we can deliver uh, more frequently. And we're working on that too. 